YouTube, this is NJ Devil Fan 26 and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to sync up your BlackBerry Storm with your Mac. Now if you've seen my unboxing video of the BlackBerry Storm, or if you simply just own a BlackBerry Storm yourself, you'll notice that in the box it comes with two CDs, one for BlackBerry User Tools and one for VZ Access Manager. However, both of those CDs are for Windows computers. So in order to sync up your BlackBerry with your Mac, you're going to need two things. One to change one of the settings on your BlackBerry Storm. And the second thing you're going to need is an application which you can see right over here called Pocket Mac Sync Manager. Pocket Mac Sync Manager is a third party application that allows you to sync up your BlackBerry with your Mac. So first let's change the setting on the BlackBerry. So let's open it up. Let's make more applications show and let's go to options. Then you scroll down and look for something called Auto Enable Mass Storage Mode when connected. By default, the BlackBerry has this as set to no, but we want to change that to yes. This enables it so when you plug in your BlackBerry to your Mac, it shows up as a USB device, like any other USB device would. Next, you're going to need to download Pocket Mac Sync Manager. Pocket Mac Sync Manager is a $5 application on the Pocket Mac website. However, I have uploaded my copy of Pocket Mac Sync Manager, and you can download that file by clicking on the link in the description of the video. Alright, so now I already have that installed. So before I open that up, I want to plug in my BlackBerry. So I'll take in my micro USB to USB connector and I'll plug that in to my BlackBerry. Now once I've done that, it'll go it'll automatically go to this view over here where you see the clock. Now I'm going to open up Pocket Mac Sync Manager. So let's open that up. Alright, so it loaded and you'll see two, three things. Dot Mac, Blackberry, and Sync. So what you want to do first is click on Blackberry. Now it's recognized my device right over here as Blackberry 305C19F0. Now you need to configure it. So let's go over to the tab here that says contacts and you can choose to sync up the contacts with the BlackBerry with address book which is the default address book application that comes on the Mac Entourage 2008, Entourage contacts, Lotus Notes, to, Notes Note 7 contacts or meeting maker contacts now I want to back up all my contacts to address book contacts because quite frankly I think the address book is perfectly fine contacts application Next, you want to configure your calendar because what's a BlackBerry without using it for managing your whole life using a calendar? So I'm gonna. You can choose to either sync that up with Entourage 2008 Calendar, Entourage Calendar, Lotus Note 7 Calendar, Meeting Maker Calendar, Now Calendar, or iCal. So I have it checked off to use iCal because I use iCal, which comes with the Mac. Then for your tasks. You can either use Entourage 2008 Tasks, Entourage Tasks, Lotus Note 7 Tasks, Meeting Maker Tasks, Now Tasks, or iCal Tasks. Again, I'm using iCal. Now, there is no application to sync up notes except your sticky notes, which you get by going to the dashboard. Next, you can sync up your bookmarks with your computer but you'll have to install a third-party application over here where it says to and it'll take you directly to the website to install that next you can sync up your email you can copy your BlackBerry messages which you've already received on your BlackBerry to your mail application or any other application that they have to choose from like Entourage Mail, OSX Mail, Entourage 2008 Mail OSX Mail is the default mail application that comes with Mac OS X Leopard Redelivery, email redelivery, so then Pocket Mac can redeliver your mail messages to your Mac. Now, I don't want that because I already get my messages both on my BlackBerry and my mail, so I'm not going to check that off. Now, a really neat thing about Pocket Sync Manager is that it also has the feature, just like BlackBerry Tools for Windows does, to sync up all your iTunes music regardless if it has DRM or not. Now, I don't want to do that right now, but if I did, I would just 
check off music, movies, TV shows, or whatever I wanted to sync up. You can also sync up all your photos with iPhoto, and you can do it as a two-way transfer. So then if you have photos on your BlackBerry, those get imported into iPhoto automatically. Or if you have photos on your Mac that you don't have on your BlackBerry, those will sync up to that. And connection is just the way that Pocket Mac Sync Manager is going to connect to your BlackBerry. So I have everything I want checked off, so now I press the sync button. Let's go over back to the BlackBerry. You'll see this icon pop up with the computer and the BlackBerry. Now let's go back into BlackBerry Sync Manager and you'll see when it's done. I'd like to restore all. Restore all. All right, so it's done. So now we can close Pocket Sync Manager. And let's go over to the BlackBerry. Now, I already had everything on the BlackBerry. So what I want to do is see if it backed up. So let's go over to Address Book. And we will see that it has all of my contacts right over here. So it looks like it worked. Well, that is my tutorial on how to use Pocket Sync Manager for Mac with the BlackBerry Storm. If you have any questions, you can leave a comment on this video, or you can simply just drop me a line at njdoublefan26 at gmail.com, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.